This is Fran Hi, this is Francisco Bujan from vitalcoaching.com. We are talking about breakups for men and the topic for this video is she broke up because she's confused with her life. Very often a woman when she breaks up will tell you things like, I don't know who I am anymore, I have to find myself again. Um, when I'm with you, I, I am actually quite happy, I'm okay, but there is something more I want to discover from life. Or simply you, you realize and discover that she's not uh, very emotionally stable, you know, she might be under medication, she might be depressed, you know, these kind of things. And she, reala she realizes that when she's in your presence, when she's with you, she doesn't really know how to solve or manage to solve her challenges. She has to go back to a space where it's about her, about her individuality rather than about the couple you are in. So when this happens, uh, very often the tendency will, will be to want to help her, want, want to be supportive with her, these kind of things. And uh, what I want to tell you is that as a guy, as a couple, or as a partner, as a lover, you are not her therapist, okay? You are not supposed to be solving her problems, uh, trying to, um, you know, to, to be the person who is going to come up with a solution. This solution has to come from within her and she's on the path to solving whatever issues she has in her life right now. Now, you might think, okay, that's a pity because I really want to help her. I really think I can be very supportive. And you can be supportive as a friend, but you know, most of the times when somebody tells you something like that, it means that they are not really comfortable in a relationship right now. It might be your presence, it might be something in you that is overpowering her, not giving her maybe enough space to uh, recover her power, focus on, on herself, these kind of things. Whatever it means, this is one of the key deal breakers, you know, one of the key reasons women invoke when wanting to break up with somebody. And uh, sometimes it's just, it's, it is just an excuse, right? Sometimes she will say, you know, it's me, uh, I don't know who I am, I, I, I don't know what I want from my life anymore, these kind of things. She will give you an excuse which is just a lame excuse uh, uh, instead of telling you the truth, maybe she has other reasons. Maybe she did meet somebody else and she's in love with that other person. Maybe she, um, you know, simply falls out of love uh, from you with you and uh, she, uh, she simply doesn't enjoy the relationship anymore. There can be other reasons and she will give you this type of, uh, of reasons simply so that you don't feel bad about yourself or feel guilty. So it might be an excuse, you know, just not to give you the real reason. Um, but again, you know, we have uh, two main ways of standing in life. The first way is really as an individual. That's where you are at when you are born, when you are within a family context. You know, parents, you are a kid, you grow up, grow up you, uh, you are a teenager. Uh, eventually, you end up being in life as an adult. And sometimes in this adulthood, you will be in the position of an individual. It means that you are going to be single. And uh, it's during this period of singlehood that sometimes you discover very key aspects about your life. It allows you to be faced just with yourself and it's only, you're only accountable to yourself. You don't owe anything to anybody. And within that context, sometimes this allows you to make decisions about your life, you know, make key choices that you would not be able to make when somebody else is right there next to you. So that's probably what she's going through if this is a, a reason she's invoking right now. She simply needs her space to recover uh, and find um, who she is, uh, you know, in the core of, uh, of her being. And that's, that's fair enough. All you can do is step back, uh, respect that. Uh, should you turn this whole relationship into a new friendship when you where you become a very supportive friend, um, you might, but at the same time it can keep you stacked and maybe you hope that she will go through it and eventually get back together with you, but imagine, imagine that she starts dating somebody else, eventually has a relationship with another person. How will you feel if you have been supporting her in taking all these positive steps for, for her in, in her life? If you are ready to let go, you know, that's, that's fine. You can turn this relationship into a friendship, that's a possibility, but most of the times I would say refocus on your life. Because right now, if you are reading uh, this material, if you are um, accessing this uh, breakup system, it means that you are the one who needs, uh, you know, help, focus, energy, power right now. So uh, dare to be selfish, dare to refocus your energy on yourself. Think about yourself first. 
um, that's okay. That's something that you are entitled to. Okay, I hope this makes sense. Take care and enjoy. Bye-bye.